Hello there. Hello everybody, welcome back to your favourite FC24 series on YouTube. It's Beer Goalkeeper, episode 43. In the last episode, we of course moved to FC Augsburg, which is quite a big jump, I suppose, from going to the Scottish League to the Bundesliga. And people aren't too happy about it, I know, but to be fair, I think it's a pretty good average team. And to be fair, I don't want to go too far in these leagues. I'm quite happy to join a lower league team and see if we can get them somewhere else, maybe even top of the league, maybe even win the league. You never know. Oh, my leg! But to my surprise, we are actually in the Europa League, so it's quite interesting to see. And the first match is in the Europa League, but before we get into that, remember to leave a like on the video, really just have my channel, subscribe if you're new, and turn the notification on so you don't miss a thing. Let's get into it. First match is against, I think this is Atalanta, right? I'm not too sure, but we are actually getting our full debut in the Europa League, so we will take that every day of the week, and seven minutes into it, we're actually down the right side of the pitch. Great work, they get the shot off and sneak the ball past the goalkeeper at that near post. Eight minutes in, that's how we like to start these games. What I said about his team at absolute monster i'm not sure who scored i'm still learning i'm trying my best but look at that from my right back there bullies the man get off him drills the ball across the box first time shot two defenders in his face that doesn't stop him goalkeeper at the nippers can't get down quick enough and we're in the lead a great start but only a few minutes later atalanta get their first opportunity play around the ball edge of box into the box and takes a shot i'm across my line pretty easy save in the end push it out wide and then from a corner the other side they play it short a man comes out hit the ball at the near post and our defender actually blocks it. i would have been there as well but again another corner outside the edge of the box now walks it into the box takes a shot and i'm across my line again with another save that is actually a pretty good save in the end the shot is through many men in the box look how many people are blocking my vision i get across full stretch keep it out no problem in the end and we're still keeping this clean sheet 35th minute we finally get another attack this time down the left side play it just to the edge of the box now and the man in the mid takes the shot but no he gets tackled took too long to lift his leg up pretty disappointed in the end and now we're literally at the end of the first half look at the time and space he has tries a long range and no problem for me push it out and eventually my man does clear his line and half time is blown we are winning this match 1-0 it was Maya with the goal we're struggling a little bit defensively. They are getting a few shots off, but we are keeping our cool and our composure there. Let's hope that can continue into the second half. We actually do get the first opportunity. Drilled into the box, gets the shot off and sneaks it past. But he is offside. I can't believe it. Have a look at yourself, linesman. He looked well onside from my eyes. Look at the run. The pass is beautiful as well. Look how close it is. Literally a foot offside. I cannot believe it. That would have given us the extra bit of cushion we needed. But still, we are under a bit of pressure. They get their first chance in the second half and the 70th minute. Look at the time he has. But again, I am there with another okay save. I will take this. Only five minutes left. I'm still trying to get this goal back. Lays off edge of the box. I'm full stretch again. I am on absolute fire. 88th minute. They're not giving up. They're trying to get long range off the woodwork. And I think I actually get a touch to it. Let's have a look at this angle. It looks like I get a fingertip just there. I do push it onto the post. Keeping that ball out. I want this clean sheet. Woo! I cannot believe how much pressure they've done, but they can't do any more. We actually win the match 1-0. Look at the rating as well. That's why he's the GOAT! A fully deserved man of match. We had one shot on target, apparently, and we won. So it's looking pretty good for this team so far. But now we have a massive match. We're against Union Berlin, and they're actually top of the table at this current time. We are at home, so can we get a surprise point or three points out of this game? Let's find out. 13th minute, look at that run and a through ball. Back to it, a little one, two, so hits it near post. And their goalkeeper's actually restless, and I do do a live goalkeeper campaign with that goalkeeper, so it's good to see him. But look at that for a bit of skill move by our right mid. Or striker, I don't know his position, but either way, the first half is done already. Not a lot happened. Berlin did nothing. We had one okay opportunity. Their goalkeeper didn't even need to save it, but he did anyway. Into the second half, and I'm sure it's going to be a load better because it can't be much worse. We get the first attack just into the box and hits it across the goalkeeper and gets the goal. 56 minutes on the clock. What a goal that is. They give Beltran too much space onto his left foot. Look at him. Just wanders into the box. The centre back does literally nothing. Gives him that huge gap there. Hits it across the goalkeeper it looks like he might have got a touch to it or is it just the way the ball travels either way into the back of there and we are one nil up and only 15 minutes left of this match of berlin finally bucked the ideas up get the ball into the box what can they do nothing because i am there again and then i get subbed off i can't believe it one shot 6.9 rating nice 
but it doesn't matter. We go on to win the match 2 0. Maya with a goal again in the 82nd minute. Another clean sheet to add to my collection. Moving on to the third match, this time away from home at Schalke in the Poco? Pokal? I'm not sure what it is. Maybe it's like the FA Cup version in Germany. I'm not too sure, but six minutes in, they get a golden opportunity. It's body face. I push it onto Woodwork and then the defender pushes it back onto the same post. Pretty weird save to be fair. I think I should be doing better. I kind of move away, but push it onto the post once more. That post has saved me so many times. And my defender does a fantastic job to get a touch to it just there. Kick it onto the post again. We definitely get away with one, but we will take it. But 11 minutes in, they're back on the ball just outside the box. The ball falls to the body face again. I push it wide. My defender does clear the lines. Gave him too much time for that shot, but finally we get an opportunity. Look at the space he has. Right foot over the crossbar. Tried finesse it into that top corner. Missed it completely, but again, we have time in that box near post. I don't think he should be shooting from that angle, but from the corner, we play around the, just inside the box. I hold off the defender. Again, waiting for some run. More strength shown. Again, just holding him off. Plays it back to him, strikes it. The keeper makes a little bit of a meal of it, but just push it out from the corner. And from that corner, literally a carbon copy back out to the right. What can we do? A little ball roll. Defender gets a tackle and then he pushes him out the way, shows some strength into chips up and goalkeeper is out quickly. They do clear their lines eventually. We have been all over Schalke in the second part of this first half and again down the right side into the box. What can he do? Plays it back to him. Defenders do block it but he takes a weird shot to keep a full stretcher. I don't know what he's doing but he kept the ball out and that's all that matters. Half time, all tied up, nil nil. We should have got at least one goal, but we keep dominating it down that right side of the pitch. Hitting at the near post and the keeper's matching it every time. Into the second half, what can Schalke do? They're down on our right side of the pitch towards the Bayern now. What can do? Hits it off the woodwork and me. And we do get a goal kick, but look how fortunate this time. Hits the post off my knee, back onto his knee and out for a goal kick. We're getting so lucky, but Boniface is determined to get a goal. Showing some strength there. Holds everyone off, hits it. Just over the cross by the way, and he found that top corner. 67 minute, we're on our first attack in the second half. Little back heel, takes a shot, straight at the goalkeeper though. Again, a little bit flappy with his hands over, again, keeps it out. 76 minute, balled into the box, oh, what a ball that is. Oh my God. I got so excited, I skipped a replay by accident, but look at the ball into the box, the touch as well. BEA, beautiful, finesse it into that top corner. Love to see it, we are in the lead, but another ball here across the pitch. He brings it under a spell, finds the man, edge of the box, tries to finesse it again, and over the bar again he's so unfortunate he's done pretty well but can't quite get his finishing boots on now last opportunity possibly five minutes in ball whipped in there on the volley he finally gets his goal third time lucky i don't even know who this is number 11 has been trying and trying and finally finds the back of the net with an absolute beauty balls is whipped into no man's land and smashes it on the volley watches it all the way the keeper puts him under pressure but it's not quite Fully stretched, look at under his arm in the end. Unfortunately, but we do move on further in the poker. 2 0. Woo, seven rated for myself. Only the one save, but I've played the full match. Their goalkeeper got absolutely peppered. But now we move on to the final game of the episode. It is away from home once again, this time at VFL Wolfsburg. Look at that stadium by the way. Bit of a kick clash, all green. The pitch is green, so it's kind of hard to see. Trust me, I couldn't do nothing about it, but we start off pretty strong. A great through ball. It takes a shot and a keeper full stretch with a nice little save to start this game off. Again, we're on another attack. 18 minutes in, get a shot from a weird angle. The keeper, no problem. And this dude just slides onto the floor. 30 second minute, Wolfsburg get the first opportunity straight at me. What? Ooh, this game's trash! I just can't get away from stuff like this. It happens every episode, every match. It's ridiculous. Paradis nuts scored against me. Cannot believe it. It's straight at me, and I just dive out the way. Like, I can't get my head around what is going on with this game. <laughs> just look at the... Why is he turning his body like that? If he stands up straight, just crouch down a little bit, would have saved it. That is half time though. Not looking good for me. I'm on like a 4.0 rating. So one shot, one goal, and I'm probably going to get subbed off in about the 10 minutes into the second half. But we do start off second half strongly with a goal there. And literally, that's our bread and butter. Down the right side, with the ball in the middle. Beltran this time gets onto the end of it. But look how much time and space he has. The gap in the middle between two centre-backs in the six-yard box. The goal Goalkeeper can't do nothing. He's made himself as big as possible, but again, under the arm, all tied up now. And it looks like we've got some confidence because we get another free ball into the box. What can he do? Plays it across the sweaty goes there, but he missed the man and they clear their lines. And then I get subbed off. To be fair, it's expected. One shot, one goal. But it doesn't matter because we won the game and it's Beltran again scoring in the 69th minute. We went 2 1. And people said this team's bad. We won every game today. Unbelievable. Look at the clean sheet. So you can see we have one in six because they count substitute appearances. Dubravka has one in six as well. So we're 
twinsies, or whatever. But I'll tell you this, Beltran 3 in 6. We also have Prass 2 in 6. Obviously, there's a few Kondogbias up there from uh, Berlin. But top goal scorer Kane, 6 in 6. Nunes up there, 5 in 6. Do we have anyone with Beltran 4 in 6? Anyone else on there from us? No. Beltran carrying the goals for this team at the moment. But that's going to be it for today's episode. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, don't forget to leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new and turn notifications on so you don't miss a thing. And as always, look after yourself, stay safe, and I'll speak to you next time. Goodbye.